I'm John Grayson and I'm researching the um, lost craftsmanship used in the production of 18th century enamels that were predominantly produced in the West Midland area, Birmingham, Wensbury and Bilston. I'm a craftsmaker as well as a, an academic and a researcher um, and probably about 10 years ago, I think it was 2004, I was invited to do a project with Bilston Craft Gallery making uh, contemporary craft work in response to their internationally renowned collection of 18th century enamels. Um, so it's uh, a touring exhibition, um, it's co-curated by the Vittoria Street Gallery here at the School of Jewellery uh, in conjunction with Ruthin Craft Centre in Wales. Um, so it goes here, Ruthin, and then it goes to Wolverhampton Art Gallery at the end. Um, the exhibition is about the journey of investigation within the research. So it starts, there's three key zones. So the first zone is to do with the collection of data uh, within the museum. So in, uh, object analysis, so inspecting objects um, that were in the museum stores. Then I created um, some general hypotheses of, of how uh, elements of the objects may have been constructed so this kind of surfaced a range of making processes I then explored those through my own practice so I brought that into the contemporary and I applied this set of making processes to the making of contemporary craft work so the theory being that that would allow me to understand the material qualities of these different construction processes to gain better knowledge and then that allowed me to revisit my data from the museums um, and construct a final set of theories of how key objects that I'd inspected in the museums, uh, how they were made. And then I tested my theory by trying to make replicas of those objects. So if you come and look at the exhibition, uh, we're, ha we're borrowing from Wolverhampton Art Gallery uh, for 18th century enamels and I've got replicas of three of those so you can compare uh, and make your own judgment about whether the processes have led to the production of these 18th century pieces.